Hey there, I'm John Lytle. I'm an illustrator and I'm going to be showing you how to make a paper treehouse. You're going to need uh, crayons, some paints and brushes, or some colored pencils. Whichever you want to uh, color and make lines with, that's up to you. And to construct the treehouse, you're going to need some construction paper, some scissors, make sure you have a grown-up kids, and a glue stick or tape, an eraser, and a pencil. All right, let's go ahead and make a treehouse. We're going to start with two brown pieces of construction paper, and this will, we are going to create the outside of our treehouse. I have a black color pencil and a regular pencil and some scissors. So you can use whatever you want. Uh, you can use crayon or paints if you want. But I'm choosing a color pencil. And on the first sheet, I'm going to make a circle. And I would just kind of do this. There we go. I'm going to add in some uh, lines for like the texture, the bark of a tree, just giving it some character. You can also kind of do this however you want. I'm just going simple. You can like add bugs or I don't know. You can add like extra little holes in there if you wanted to. And on the next sheet, kind of do the same thing some texture all right we're good to go on that and I'm gonna match these up we're going to cut these so they can connect together I'm going to start by labeling each side. Um, you can do this lightly. So one, two, I might, or I'm sorry, one. And those, so those sides match. And I would just flip those over and then do the, do the same thing here, but label it number two. Also, if you have an eraser, you can get rid of those numbers, and I'll show you that in a second. So after I put, on, put down the numbers, I'm going to add in some uh, lines where we're going to cut. So in the middle, right there, and on top, give yourself a little bit of space up there, and the same with the bottom. There we go. And so that way when you cut these, they, they match up. Middle, top, bottom. All right, so now I'm going to cut the lines. Now all those sides are cut. All right, next we're going to match up our numbers and our, our cut lines. And we're going to kind of like snap them, like slide them in.
Okay, and there you go. We have connected our pieces together to form the treehouse. And then you can glue these sides here. Unfortunately, I don't have a glue stick with me, but you can take a glue stick and glue these sides together for a stronger hold. So I am just using some spare tape since I don't have a glue stick. So you can use either or. So you can tape your sides in or you can glue them in. So we taped all the sides together and now we're ready for the next step. On another sheet of paper, I'm going to trace a circle along the bottom. And this is going to create a, a roof for our treehouse. And then I'm going to create uh, squares on three sides. And this will help connect our, our roof. So on the top, bottom, and one on the side. And next I'm going to cut it out. And then fold the flaps. Next, we're going to take our tree house back and we're going to cut a flap in the back, or a opening in the back. So right there. And then we're going to slide our roof right through the top. I'm going to slide the one flap in the back just like that. And again, you might have to wiggle it in a little bit to get the proper fit. Use tape or glue to hold the flaps together. Okay, so now we got our roof of our treehouse. Next, you can take a green sheet of paper and put it underneath your treehouse, and it can be the, the grass. And then you can take your pencil, your crayon, or paintbrush and make little grass lines.
Next, I'm going to take another sheet of construction paper and I'm going to make some triangles here. And then I'm going to cut these out. And then next I'm going to make a little flap on each one. And then I'm going to use tape or glue. And put these on the tree house. There is the roots to our tree house, and our tree house is complete. And on the next step, I have a sheet of characters and uh, design templates that you can decorate your tree house with. So for the very final step, I have a character sheet template that we can use to have some characters to play with and some decoration for our treehouse. And you can create your own characters, you can make your own furniture, whatever you want. Uh, this is just to help you get started if you just want to go ahead and start having fun and still create something. So I have a ghost here and I have a frog. You can use crayons, uh, paints, whatever you feel like using to color these in. Oh, and you can also use googly eyes for um, all the characters that you create. You can even put them on your treehouse. Maybe your treehouse is the living uh, thing. So next we can cut these guys out. And for the chair, you can bend these down and have it stand up. So fold that right there. And there you go. You got a little leaf chair. You might have to kind of practice it, balancing it out for a little bit. There's your little leaf chair. And that can be, that can go like on the top. It can be like a little rooftop party going on.
There's a picture frame. I can use tape or glue. Let's put a little picture frame inside. A little tree house. Right there. Some interior decoration. And finally, I'm going to cut out the characters. And we are all set. So now our characters can have a little fun treehouse party on top. And they can also hang outside or inside when it rains. So yeah, just have fun with it. You can make up your own little things, your own little characters, create like a little story or However you want to play with it, it's your it's your creation. So, and we're all set. So there we go. So thank you for uh, watching this video, and I hope that you make an awesome treehouse, and I hope you have lots of fun. So see you later. Bye.